Hi, this is PC Roger. Welcome to this short video where I'm going to show you how to get that Internet Explorer icon on your desktop uh, for Internet Explorer 7 in Windows XP. As you may or may not know, uh, with uh, Internet Explorer 7, they, uh, Microsoft made the decision that no longer would this be one of the default icons on the desktop. And for some people, they say, hooray, I don't use it anyway. But if you want to have Internet Explorer be conveniently available like this, there is a way to get the icon back if you have either deleted it or if you um, do not have it because you maybe updated to IE7. And the way to do that is to go to Microsoft's site and uh, we are going to use Internet Explorer instead of the preferred Firefox because Microsoft programs their site, surprise, surprise, to work better with Internet Explorer. So if you go to, over to Google and just type in the search box here, how to get Internet Explorer icon on the desktop, you can see the, uh, the, the top search result here should be the support.microsoft.com knowledge base uh, article. And if you click on that, you'll find that uh, Microsoft actually does have a kind of a handy little utility with uh, a lot of their uh, knowledge base articles to just fix it. And all you have to do is click fix this problem. And you get this security warning and you can just click run. It is a, an MSI file and you click run. Then again, it'll ask you, do you want to run the software and select run? And you have to, of course, agree to their terms. You know, it's a little tiny registry fix. Uh, you could do it manually, but this, this makes sure that you don't mess up your registry. And you click Next and creates a restore point for you. And after waiting just a little bit, uh, again, because it's Microsoft, it should be no surprise that it is going to ask you to restart your computer to fix the problem. Here you get a little dialog box that says uh, the fix has been processed and you can tell them what you think or whatever. I just click close and then here of course you have to restart and you can either click yes to restart now or no to restart later. And by the time you restart you'll see that your Internet Explorer icon is back on the desktop uh, and if you like it that way then you have your solution. It's done very easily. I do recommend you use Internet Explorer. You can use Firefox, but then you have to save the MSI file to the desktop and run it independently. It's not a big deal, but a little easier with IE. So that's it for this uh, short video tip. I hope it's helped you out in some way. Please come to my website, www.pcroger.com. Got a lot of other video tips and a lot of other information there to help you with your computer. Thanks for watching.